from the students of Penn State Meteorology, here is your Penn State Campus Weather Service forecast. And a very good Friday to you, wherever you are. This is Jake and Ike here, the Penn State Campus Weather Service forecast on this April 28th, 2017. This is our last forecast of the year, so we're going to get the whole crew involved. You'll be able to see all of our four members take part in today's forecast. Weather headlines for today. A mild but tad humid start to the weekend for State College with a chance of showers overnight. For the weekend, though, not a total washout, but things are going to get quite unsettled. Showers and thunder showers in store for both Saturday and Sunday. And even into Monday, we're looking at a muggy and stormy day, but the good news is we'll be back to normal, temp normal temperatures soon after. We'll have more on that in your seven-day forecast coming up momentarily, but first, take a look at that sky over Beaver Stadium, folks. Just a few clouds in the sky right now, currently outside 61 degrees. Not too bad in the way of humidity right now, but things are going to get, get quite humid starting tonight and throughout the weekend. Currently across the Commonwealth right now, pretty toasty down to the southeastern part of the state right now. 78 Philadelphia, 76 Allentown. Off west, though, a little bit milder. 56 Bradford right now and 57 in Erie at this lunchtime. Across the Mid-Atlantic, pretty toasty down south of the Mason-Dixon line. 79 right now in Norfolk, Virginia, and 77 right now in our nation's capital. Like I said, dew points are going to be a factor going into the weekend, but right now, though, we are looking pretty dry. 43 in Bradford right now, current dew point, 45 Franklin. Off the beast, though, a little bit warmer. 59 right now in Philly and 57 in Scranton. Not quite humid yet, but certainly getting there. And now for a look at the current weather conditions across the lower 48, let's take it now to J.P. Tracy, who I will literally throw the forecast over to. Take it away, J.P. Thanks, Jake. Yes, indeed, as you said, there are a few clouds around, but right now here in Happy Valley, dealing with mostly clear skies, no showers in the state of Pennsylvania right now, a few off the coast. We had some thunderstorms roll through last night and give us a little more than a half an inch of rain, and it fell in kind of one hour. There was some minor flooding reported in the area, a couple lightning strikes, but nothing too severe last night. Like I said, right now, just dealing with these clouds right now and no showers in the vicinity, but that will change as we start to move into the weekend. Taking a look uh, as we zoom out across the country, we see this area of low pressure back towards the Midwest and Plains that's actually giving a lot of rain to Missouri and Iowa right now, and even some heavier snow in parts of Iowa and Nebraska back there, as you can see with these blue colors right here. So we won't be seeing any snow from this because the temperatures are so mild right now, but we will be seeing chances of rain increase tonight and then through the weekend and into Monday before the front finally passes and we get back to clear conditions on Tuesday. Taking a look at your futurecast radar, dealing with some partly cloudy conditions of the day, but clouds will increase as we go into the night tonight. Chance of a shower or thunderstorm overnight. And then as we move into Saturday, we will see those chances for showers and storms increase, uh, especially in the morning hours. Chances of some heavier rain and showers. And then once again, as we move on through Sunday and Monday, those showers will continue. I'm now going to pass it off to Jared Stepanski, who will talk about the current con or the conditions for this evening. Thanks, JP. For today, we'll have a high of 74 with mostly sunny skies and clouds building later in the day. A little bit breezy, not that much, with southwest winds 5 to 10 miles per hour. For those heading out to move it on later today, we'll have a good day to be out there. For 3.30, it'll be 75 degrees. 6.30, some increasing clouds, 73. And overcast by the end, 9.30 at 68 degrees. For tomorrow, be mostly cloudy, highs in the upper 70s, 77 degrees, scattered showers and thunderstorms, winds out of the west at 5 to 10 miles per hour. Now I'm going to toss it over to Andy. Thanks, Jared. Now as we take a look at your seven-day forecast, first as we start the weekend on Saturday, we're going to have some more scattered thunderstorms still getting up into the upper, upper 70s. For Sunday, only isolated showers and thunderstorms. A little bit cooler, though, only getting up to around 72. It's going to be muggy as we start off the work week, with temperatures getting up to 80, with showers and thunderstorms throughout the day. We're going to be drying out on Tuesday, fortunately, but much cooler, down to 64 degrees. Much of the same on Wednesday before the next weather maker moves in for your Thursday. Now, on behalf of the Afternoon Campus Weather Service, on behalf of me, Andrew Brightman, Jake Langerdijk, our wonderful shift manager, Jared Stepanski, our loyal member, and of course, a fellow Weather Challenge member, J.P. Tracy. We'd just like to thank you all for a great semester. It's been a lot of fun. And un until next time, enjoy the weather, people. Thanks, guys. It's been a fantastic time, everyone.